This is our fifth video of C language learning series. In this video we will learn Basic structure of C program The format or way according to which a computer program is written is called the structure of the program. The program structure of different programming languages is different. C is a structured programming language. It provides a well-defined way of writing programs. Basic structure of a C program The whole program is controlled within main, along with left brace denoted by and right braces denoted by if you need to declare local variables and executable program structures are enclosed within open brace and enclosed brace this is called body of the main function the main function can be preceded by documentation preprocessor statements and global declarations now let's talk about this structure clearly Documentation section. The documentation section consists of a set of comment lines giving the name of the program, the another name and other details, which the programmer would like to use later. We can give comments about the program, creation or modify date, author, name etc. In this section, we can divide the section into two main categories single line comments and multiple line comments. Single line comments. We can write single line comment with a double forward slash. For example, this is my first program. Multiple line comments. The characters or words or anything which are given between this and the sign won't be considered by C compiler for compilation process. These will be ignored by C compiler during compilation. For example, this is my first program and this is second. Preprocessor statements or link section The preprocessor statement begin with sharp symbol and are also called the preprocessor directive. These statements instruct the compiler to include C preprocessors such as header files and symbolic constants before compiling the C program. Some of the preprocessor statements are sharp include stdio, dot h sharp include math, dot h sharp include conio, dot h. Definition section, all the symbolic constants are written in definition section, macros are known as symbolic constants. For example, global declarations, the variables are declared before the main function as well as user defined functions are called global variables. These global variables can be accessed by all the user-defined functions including main function. Now very important part of structure is the main function. Each and every C program should contain only one main. The C program execution starts with main function. No C program is executed without the main function. The main Function should be written in small letters and it should not be terminated by semicolon. Main function executes user-defined program statements, library functions and user-defined functions and all these statements should be enclosed within left and right braces means with curly braces. We can divide main function's body into two parts. First declaration part and second executable part. We will learn this clearly in our future videos. Local declarations. The variable declaration is a part of C program and all the variables are used in main. Functions should be declared in the local declaration section is called local variables. Not only variables, we can also declare arrays, functions, pointers etc. These variables can also be initialized with basic data types. For example, here, the variable sub is declared as integer variable and it is initialized to zero. Other variables declared as int and float and these variables inside any function are called local variables. Program statements these statements are building blocks of the program. They represent instructions to the computer to perform a specific task. 
an instruction may contain an input output statements, arithmetic statements, control statements, simple assignment statements and any other statements and it also includes comments that are enclosed within slash asterisk and asterisk slash. User defined functions. These are set programs. Generally, a set program is a function and these functions are written by the user are called user defined functions. These functions are performed by user specific tasks and this also contains set of program statements. They may be written before or after a main function and called within main function. This is an optional to the programmer, an example of user defined functions. That's all. Please comment below your problems. Give your email address in the comment box. We will send the notes of this topic. If you like our video then press the like button on YouTube. Don't forget share our videos with your friends. Please please subscribe our channel and get new video updates in your mailbox. Thanks for watching and keep visiting.